Welcome back to my channel, Marasakas. Hey. So this video, we're going to be talking about baby fat and the relaunch of baby Marasak and fat. It's also going to be kind of like a dark skin complexion get ready with me video. A lot of my videos you guys are constantly complimenting me either on my makeup or my skin. Um, right now I have nothing on my face. My brows are done and I have some eye makeup. But I have nothing on my face and I wanted to show you guys because you guys think that my face is flawless and oh your skin is so flawless and thank you for thinking that but no one is flawless because no one is perfect yet we are perfect because we're not perfect. You get what I'm trying to say? You have on an eye cream. I've already moisturized my face and now I'm going to prime my face. I, for the most part, I use two primers because I do have combination skin. Um, my skin is a little bit more on the oily side and I am prone to breakouts like at this age. Why am I still going through teenage acne? Like I've been using a product lately that broke my freaking skin out. That's what happened. That's what happened. I'm gonna talk about that in a separate video though. She not getting no time today. And for most dark skinned women, we do have hyperpigmentation um, around our mouth area, just meaning that this area tends to be a lot darker than the rest of our face. And that's fine. You can just go in, color correct with a color corrector. I like to color correct with this primer from Makeup Forever. I've been using it forever and it's really good. Baby fat is coming back, y'all. Wait, I gotta throw in the clap sounds. I gotta throw in the clap sounds. because like where she went in the first place like what happened to baby fat i got my notes <laughs> but yeah so kimora lee simmons you know the face of baby fat baby fat was her baby um her and her husband at the time russell simmons russell simmons had fat farm and kimora had baby fat so it was like the men's wear and the women's wear it was street urban wear i used the blurring primer on my forehead and at the center of my face because that's where I get the most oils around here forehead area using the cover FX blurring primer this is really good if you have large pores or if you have a lot of texture on your skin girl sis gonna just smooth smooth it out and lay a good foundation for your foundation that I color correct down here sometimes under my eye I don't necessarily have dark circles but I do have deep set eyes so sometimes it does, it does like cast a shadow. So I'll use it there as well. Baby Fat and Fat Farm. Fat Farm was the men's streetwear. Baby Fat was the women's streetwear. And it was very Kimora Lee Simmons. Like if you know Kimora Lee Simmons, it was very Kimora Lee. Like very glamorous. You know, the fur, the diamonds, the glitter. Cute. So yeah, so according to my research... <laughs> Baby fat was established in 1999. I still got glitter on my eye from yesterday. I hate that. Like, glitter will forever be on your face. Like, you put glitter on your face once, that's it. That's it. Peak of baby fat. Baby fat pulled in $1 billion. US dollars. At the peak. So, like, the highest. Okay. Sis, you a billionaire, sis. I really love Kamora Lee Simmons because she is such an innovative entrepreneur. She's just like the woman, like, she's a woman's woman. Like, she is for the girls, with the girls, by the girls, okay? As a black and Asian woman, she, you know, she went through her own set of struggles in the fashion industry. I saw some videos of her saying, you know, I was never black enough for the black girls. I was never Asian enough for the Asian girls. So she kind of created her own lane in the fashion industry, started her own brands, and she always included other women. You know what I mean? She didn't just want the traditional white models. She included dark models, light models, mixed Six models, this models, eight models, kids, cats, 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 cats. We stand a queen that incorporates all beauty. Always. Here are a few of my favorite foundations. I really love the Makeup Forever Matte Velvet. Good for the oily girls. I love the Too Faced Born This Way. I actually did a review video on this. You can check that out. The Makeup Forever HD, it actually grew on me because I never used to like this. I was like, ugh, like, cause I like coverage. Like I like a beat, 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 go Bayside. Like I want my face beat, snatched to the gods. It's no in-betweens with me. It's I'm beat or I have no makeup on. It's no reason for me to be in between. I'm sorry. Like, <laughs> that's just my life. Gotta have her fancy. And my shade is 
tiramisu. I will list all the shades and all the products that I use, so don't worry, you guys will know. Kimora posted it on her Instagram. Um, I believe the Shade Room posted it. And I was just so excited that I had to just like do more research. I just never knew what happened with baby fat. Like I didn't know if it was just like, you know, we're, we just don't wanna do it anymore. I feel like when you're younger, you know, you don't understand business when you're a kid. So, you, you know, when something stops, it's just like, oh my God, why did it stop? And it's like no real answer. So you just go on without it. Like, and Kimora, you know, in one article, Kimora did not want to announce, you know, which company, which company did she buy it back from? How much did she buy it back for? So, of course, I had to do my own little nosy behind research because you're not just going to tell me that you ain't going to tell me. Love the coverage on this foundation. Let me move my hair back so you guys can see. Bing, bada, boom, bada, bing, bada, boom, bada, ba, bada, bing, ka, 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 ka. Oh, wait, no, I'm not even using this one. I did all of that for no reason. But I do love the Fenty, I do. The Born This Way Concealer in the shade Chestnut. This is one of my favorite concealers of all time. First of all, I love that the applicator is huge. It's hella big, like, I actually wanna get this in a couple more colors. Um, because this one is for like when I want to highlight, 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 highlight. And I don't always want to highlight, 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 highlight. You know what I mean? Some days I just want to highlight, highlight. But yeah, so this one is really dope. I love the consistency. I love the coverage. I love the applicator. I love, I love, I love, I love. I found out that Baby Fat was actually acquired in 2004. Like, how many years after they opened? This is a concealer that you do want to work fast with. Um, it does dry down pretty quickly. Always make sure you're using a damp beauty blender. Not soaking wet, just damp. This is not a Born This Way sponsored video, by the way. I just really like the products. A Born This Way setting powder. Yes, I am. I use the shade Translucent Medium. I don't know, you guys. I don't know. My unicorn senses is telling me there was something going on, okay? That's what my unicorn senses is telling me. But the point of the matter is, is that she bought it back she got it back so ready for it because with fashion now everything is going backwards like everything goes back to the beginning you know what i mean like 90s streetwear is popping now everyone's doing theme parties because we miss those eras and you know if it doesn't have to be a party like if i feel like i want to vibe out to a 90s look for the week i'm gonna vibe out to a 90s look for the week we miss the past we do a lot of we miss the good old times right just went from 3d to flat like, where's my bags? Where's my baby bags? Deep set eyes, where? Where that? That's why I love this powder. That's why y'all need to get this powder and stop playing with me. And you don't need a lot. I don't like to use a lot at a time. Back in the day, I used to bake like everywhere, but now I only bake in the places where I get oily. That's the only place I need to bake. Like, <laughs> around my eyebrows get really oily, um, which is also why I prime my eyebrows before I put anything there area is baking i'm gonna go in with this covergirl foundation powder you guys know i love covergirl products they're very inexpensive and they get the job done okay they get the job done apply this powder everywhere that is not baking I read an article that said Kamora Lee Simmons is bringing her daughters onto the team. So we got some youth juice in the mix. Y'all know I am a huge fan of Ming and Aoki. You know, I call her Aoko. I don't know. I just like her name because it's kind of like mine. No, it's not right. Okay. Anyway, don't come for she. Ming style is very baby fat, okay? The prints, the fur, giving you leg, giving you midriff, okay? Giving you shoulder, colored glasses, lip gloss popping. That's that's the that's the baby fat aesthetic, and I'm hoping that that's gonna continue to be the baby fat aesthetic plus more. You know what I mean? I want to see neons. I want to see bright colors. I want to see baggy pants and little tops. I want to see little crop top fur jackets, okay? I want to see tiger print headbands. Like, I want it all. Matter of fact, Kimura, hit me up. I'm going to slide in Kimura's DM. I'm sliding in all of their DMs. I'm going to contour with the CoverGirl Full Spectrum Powder, and this is in the shade uh, Deep Cool 4. Y'all got to pay attention to this part because a lot of y'all ask me what's on my lips. Using a dark liquid lipstick. What did I just even say? <laughs> Lip illicit. <laughs> Y'all know what I meant.
Fenty Concealer. I use the shade 420. Poof, poof. And depending on the consistency, concealers can be a really good nude lipstick. So while that's drying down, I'm just going to press this powder in, back up, press it in, press it in, press it in, press it in, press, 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 press. So you can give the people a matte, sometimes it's nice, give the people just a matte, solid beat. That's nice. But see, I like to highlight <laughs> the cover FX. This is lit, but this one gives you, it is an illuminating setting spray. So it does give you like a kind of like, not an iridescent, but kind of like a soft, sparkly, glowy, you know what I'm trying to say? I often get carried away with setting spray because it's just like, I want more. But as you can see, it kind of just instantly like, Gave me a little bit of wet, you know, just a little wet. All right, so I like to use, we could do a whole separate video on highlight, highlighting, what's the best highlighters. But this is my go-to highlighter from Amore Cosmetics. It's called Goldmine. Already, didn't even really do nothing. Like, why does Jesus love me so much? Jesus loves me, this I know. So I can either leave my lip matte or I can add some gloss. I'm gonna add gloss because this is just what the look is calling for. I will put the information to this gorgeous unit in the description box. So be sure to check that out and use my discount code. I got y'all with the dizzy. I got you. But if I wanna do makeup, this is how I'm looking. This is what you're gonna get. You're gonna get a chocolate bar with a lot of syrup on top. So let me know guys, how do you feel about baby fat coming back? Did you wear baby fat? How do you like my beat? Let me know if you wanna see more Get Ready With Me video. Give this video a great big thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I will see you at the next one. Bye.